implement port security addressing table one switch two pcs and a rock laptop okay. one switch two pcs a laptop configure port security access the command line on s1 okay access here click here press one Command line interface, enter. Enable port security on fast Ethernet ports 0, 01 and 0, 02. Fast Ethernet ports 0, 01 and 0, 02. Enable. Configure terminal. Okay, then select the interface range. Interface range to select. Fast Ethernet 01 and 02. Enter. Enable uh, the range and enable port security. Switch port port dash security. Enter. Set the maximum so that the only one device can access the Fast Ethernet port 01 and 02. Okay, maximum one on each port. Okay. One uh, MAC address on Fast Ethernet 1 and one MAC address on Fast Ethernet 2. Switch port for security maximum 1. Enter. Secure the port so that the MAC address of a device is dynamically learned and added to the running configuration. Okay, MAC address is sticky. Switch port for security MAC address sticky mac dash address sticky enter set the violation mode so that the fast ethernet ports 0, 01 and 0, 02 are not disabled when the violation occurs but not a notification of the security violation is generated and buckets from the unknown source are dropped okay in this case is restrict Okay. If you don't want a notification, uh, should be protect. But in this case, a notification is generated, so it's restrict. Switch port security relation restrict and disable all the remaining unused ports. Okay, use this range. Only uh, Fast Ethernet 1 and 2 are in use, so select any other ports. Okay, exit. Okay, and interface range. Fast Ethernet uh, 1 and 2 in use, so 3 to 24. And gigabit 0, 01 and 0, 02. Enter. Shut down any other port. Enter. Very good. Verify. From PC1, ping PC2. Okay, access PC1. Desktop, common prompt. Okay, from PC1, ping PC2. And PC2 is 10, 10, 10, 11. Go to PC1, ping 10, 10, 10, 11. Success. Verify that the port security is enabled and MAC address of PC1 and PC2 were added to the running configuration. Okay, go to S1. Okay, you are on interface range configuration mode and to exit and use this show running config and show the section that begins with interface keyword show running config pipe begin interface enter and you can see this interface facet one mode access 
switch port for security. This port should be configured as access mode. Then, then you will be able to configure port security. Okay. And enable port security, MAC address sticky, violation restrict, and MAC address sticky. And this is the MAC address uh, learned automatically. 00 E0 B0 27 2245. Okay, Facet Ethernet 1. Facet Ethernet 1, PC 1, verify the MAC address IP config space slash all. And it's 00 E0 B0 27 2245. Okay, okay, is this a MAC address? And on fast Ethernet 2, switch port mode access, port security, MAC address sticky, violation restrict, MAC address sticky, and, and the LearNet MAC address automatically is 00016476697E. Go uh, to fast Ethernet 2 on switch 1, PC2 desktop common prompt ip config space slash all zero 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 one six four seven c six nine seven e okay very good use port security show comments s1 show port security go to s1 space 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 show port show port slash security enter and now you can see fast Ethernet one and fast Ethernet two maximum address one only one current address only one Security violation. No security violation for now. No security action restrict on both cases. And show port security address. Okay, show port security address. And okay, sorry. Address. And now you can see VLAN one. MAC address, MAC address of PC, PC1, MAC address of PC2. The type is uh, a sticky using a sticky method. This is the type. The ports, fast Ethernet 1, fast Ethernet 2. And remaining age, no age because uh, aging was not configured. Okay, aging was not configured. Attach a rock laptop to any unused switch port and notice that the link lights are red. Okay, connections, uh, use copper straight through cable, connect uh, for Ethernet 0 on laptop to S1, any other port, for example, for Ethernet 3, and indicators are red. Enable the port and verify that rock laptop can ping PC1 and PC2. Okay, this is uh, fast Ethernet 3. Go to S1, configure terminal interface, fast Ethernet 03, no shutdown, enter. Okay. You can see the green indicators. Click on the laptop, desktop, common prompt. Ping uh, from laptop to PC1. PC1 IP address is 10, 10, 10, 10. 10, 10, 10, 10. Enter. Success. And from laptop, ping PC2. And PC2 is 10, 10, 10, 11. Ping to 10, 10, 10, 11. Success. 
after verification shut down the port connected to rock laptop okay access s1 interface facet Ethernet 3 interface facet Ethernet 3 shut down enter and now is disabled red indicators disconnect pc2 and connect rock laptop to fast internet 2 okay use this uh, tool the delete tool and disconnect this port uh, the connection of pc2 also the connection for laptop and use the copper straight through cable and connect from fast Ethernet 0 on rock laptop to fast Ethernet 0 2 on the switch this port verify that rock laptop is enabled to ping pc1 okay go to rock laptop again and try to ping pc1 pc1 ip address 10 10 10 10 ping to 10 10 10 10 enter Okay, request timeout. Ping is failing and now ping fails. Display the port security violations for the port which ROG laptop is connected. On S1, show port security interface for Saturnet 2. Okay, go to S1, enter. You are on interface configuration mode and to go to privilege exit mode and show port dash security interface fast Ethernet 02. Enter. Okay, show port security interface fast Ethernet 02. Port security enabled. Port status secure app now is secure. Relation restrict. Maximum MAC address, one. Total MAC address, one. A sticky MAC address, one. Last source address is this, 0002-4A42C51C, and VLAN is number one. And security violation count is five. Okay, and review the rock laptop uh, rock laptop mac address ip config space slash all and the mac address is 0002 4a42 c5 1c okay this is the mac address and on s1 review review the show port security address enter on fast Ethernet 2, the MAC address should be 0001647C697E. But and this LearNet MAC address is not the MAC address configured on the interface fast Ethernet 02. So that's why the violation occurs. Security violation count five. How many violations have occurred? At least four. One for each ping request. Okay. One for each ping request. At least four, but in my case, five. Disconnect rock laptop and reconnect PC2. Verify PC2 can ping PC1. Okay, disconnect the laptop and connect PC2. And from PC2 ping PC1. Go to PC2 space and ping PC1. 
think the PC1 IP address is 10, 10, 10, 10. Ping, uh, 10, 10, 10, 10. Enter. Success. Why is PC2 able to ping PC1 but the rogue laptop is not? The port security that was enabled on the port only allowed the device whose MAC address was learned first. And also, only one MAC address is permitted. Thank you very much.